Coach Ford, after the uh, home opening win over Reinhardt, Coach, I'll ask you to uh, give an opening statement. I thought our guys competed hard tonight. Uh, we tried to play as a team, 18 assists, which is a good sign for us. And, and I thought we limited our turnovers in the second half. Um, probably a, a few too many threes, and, and we've got to get more of a balance to our offense, and we will uh, as the season goes along. But uh, I, I didn't think that anyone shot any contested shots, may, maybe some quick ones. But uh, we, we also made 14, which is a good sign as well. So, um, And then defensively, we, we will have to go back and watch the tape to really see if we were executing the things that, that we should have been executing. So. Um, overall, just pleased to get a win and, and get the uh, bad taste out of our mouth. Defensively, at Kansas forced 20 turnovers tonight, 16. Uh, just talk a little bit about, and you had to look at it, but just on, on paper, what you thought about it. Yeah, you know, I, I thought we missed some opportunities to, to create some more, to, to be quite honest. And, and I think that's something that this team will have to do uh, more than we, what we've done in the past. Uh, we are a little leaner, a little faster, a little smaller than what we've what we've been traditionally. So we are going to definitely have to uh, turn people over. And uh, the, the, the number that we're searching for is 20. And I know that's a big number, but uh, throughout our first two games, we're sitting at 18 a game. So um, we're, we're right on track. Down with 22 points, what did you see out of him? I thought he shot the ball with confidence. I, I, thought, he, I thought he took good shots. Um, he, he knows that, that he has the green light here as long as it's a good shot. Oh, uh, as well as other guys, and, and I was I was pleased with his performance tonight in the sense of I didn't think he tried to press it. He tried to play to his strength, which is shooting, and, and then a couple times there some other things opened up for him. So I, I was I was definitely pleased with, with Delano. And then a newcomer, uh, Pomar McKnight with 14. Got to be nice to have a new guy step up like that. Yeah, you know, we're still searching. Uh, we, we don't have a, a rotation in place. You know, I, I know guys that have played the last couple of years are going to be in the rotation. But uh, we're, we're still searching different uh, uh, player combinations, and, and we need to see what people can do under the lights. Um, uh, Stokely and, and Kmar were available for the entire game tonight, and, and those will be – they will be guys that play. And uh, last game they, they both had good second halves, and then tonight I thought they both – played, you know, decently well, considering uh, their first game at, at home and, and being new to the system. And then uh, looking ahead to Saturday, Middle Tennessee, uh, just talk a little bit about spacing off with them. Yeah, I mean, just one of the best programs in America. Um, one of very few that have won NCAA tournament games the last two years. And um, I'm not even looking at them tonight. I'm just going to enjoy this one and, and start watching them tomorrow. But. Obviously going to be well coached, going to be tough. Got an All-American in Giddy Potts, and um, hopefully we can get a good turnout. I, I thought tonight we, we had a great turnout of fans. Uh, I think someone said around 1,600, which is good for a home opener against, against an NAI on a Monday night. So um, we'll need that plus many more on Saturday. Thanks, Coach. Thanks, bud.